Hello there, everybody. Welcome back. More, more Binding of Isaac. It's an Eve run because life sucks. <laughs> life sucks. I'm recording this right after the last one. Uh, if you did not see the last video, it was, uh, oh, you know what? This is a cruel sick joke, to be honest with you. I know you're going, Tyler, why complain about Guppy's tail? Go watch the last video, and then, and then you can, you can see why I might be a little bit irritated at getting Guppy's tail immediately on this run. Oh well, dude. Oh well, it's one step closer to getting Guppy so the game can crash again on me and I can cry my eyes out. Okay. We're okay. We're, we're not gonna go to the item room. Because I enjoy the pain. We're gonna instead get a key, go down the downpour early. We're, this is gonna be the most stacked run you've ever seen. I'm telling you that right now. You're, you're looking at it right now, you're going, Tyler, I don't really see what you're talking about. Also, there's your HUD in case you wanna cry yourself to sleep tonight because I didn't turn it on. Okay, it's a little, a little salty to be honest. Um, but let's, it's a wholesome channel, okay? It's a wholesome channel. I want everybody, here, social experiment, all right? I want everybody to put a comment on the video that says, Hi. Sure, we'll just do that. We'll say if you put a video, a comment on the video that just says hi, maybe add an exclamation point to prove that you're enthusiastic about this. If you do that, that means that you are willing to be a part of the social experiment. I need you to then go to another person that commented hi, uh, introduce yourself, and tell them uh, one interesting, tell them what your favorite item in Isaac is. All right, and we're just gonna have a big wholesome comment section filled with people uh, saying what their favorite item in Isaac is, uh, and maybe you all can make friends if you have the same favorite items. That's my wholesome experiment of the day. Where was this going? I don't remember, actually. What else is new? Tyler and completely forgetting uh, what the hell's going on. Yo, look at the value that came out of this room. Gotta love that. I will say one thing we don't have value of right now. We don't have any freaking keys, uh, which makes it difficult to go down to downpour. Your moment Terra La. Get bombed, sucker. We we need to get some keys. These black flies can't hurt me. Can't hurt me no more. Oh what is love? These black flies can't hurt me. They can't hurt me no more. Uh, I should definitely not use this key to go into the shop. Keep saying it to yourself, Tyler. I should not use the key to go into the shop. I should not use the key to go into the shop. Using the key to go into the shop. Where the hell are we? <gasps> Dude, I have a hermit card. I can just go into the shop. Okay, much better. Much better. You're all going, what a dummy this guy is. I'm also going to bomb this. Why? I have no idea, but maybe I'll pick up Voodoo Pin. Voodoo Head. More more curses. Why Why did I take this? Can anybody offer me a, a good opinion as to why I took this? Give me Bob's Brain Frigate, dude. Okay, I, I cannot bring myself to ruin my downpour chances immediately. As much as I would love to open that other chest because I have a feeling that Cricket's head is just sitting inside of it waiting for me. I can't bring myself to do it. Give me Bob's brain. Bingo, bango. Um, consolation prize is, is going to be a range up, so I'd rather have the tears up here. It's only a tears up in one of my ears, but I don't care. It, it's just just as much the same for me. Uh, can I find our secret room? Think right here. Okay. Can I find the super secret room? Because <laughs> that room offered me zero value. Zero. A negative amounts of value. Not a, not a singular bit of value. This is your super secret room. You know what? I don't care enough. Just, just go down. <laughs> Screw it, dude. Screw it. I need more keys, though. Because I got I got item rooms to find on this floor. I got all kinds of crap I got to find on this floor. I also have a devil deal I need to get on this floor so we can get into 
a horror of the Babylon mode forever and ever and ever and ever. Almost a good shot by that guy, but not today, you sucker. Get bombed. Do I want to go into the curse room immediately? No, we'll go at the end of the floor after I have received my devil deal and am exceeding at life. Golden chest. Th this is one of those runs where you're never going to have enough keys because of Guppy's tail. I mean, it's just going to keep on pushing them out 24-7. But that that's okay. Even a bombs or key right here is a lockdown. Would be useful. Oh, look, it's, it's another golden chest. That's what you get for taking Guppy's tail. It can be a blessing and a curse, dude. It, it can. But it does mean that, like, one golden key puts you your set for life on one of these floors. Honestly, I kind of wanted that to hit the back, guys, but I'm getting greedy at this point. I, I'm good with just letting you rain hell from above. Give me back uh, Bob's brain. Thank you. And then we'll do this real quick. The little rain maker. I'll make it rain. I got, I got no issues making it rain on you, you son of a gun. Almost, I, I was going to say almost a good shot, but then he hit me, so it was literally a good shot. Um, Coming here first, I have to take it. And then because of that, I'll take this. I mean, it's, it's in all seriousness, a absolutely horrendous uh, situation for us. I'm not going to say I'm upset about another blank card run. Blank card is a, a beautiful boy who cannot be uh, cannot be considered bad at any any point of his young career. We're watching with high interest. Give me a key, please, though. Oh, more curses is more cursed rooms, dude. Not more curses as in the curses. Double pheromones. Okay. Um. This could be the the secret super secret. Uh, you have to go for, like, we don't have anything better to do on this floor. I have to skip the item room because I don't have any keys. We've seen this story before uh, where we just straight up don't have keys to do anything. Where we might end up with some value on this run is uh, getting, like, a stars card or a hermit card. Being able to, to still get into our, our rooms. But for the time being... We're in a, a little bit of a, a dicier position due to the the hell that we have been put through. But that's that that's okay. A little bit of hell just leads to a more successful future. That that stands true most of the time, right? You gotta go through hardships in life to have a have a successful future. People that uh don't go through hardships, that's it's not, it's not the best. So if you're ever feeling down and you, uh, you're going, I don't know how I'm going to get the heck out of this. Just realize that there's a, there's a real good chance that in the end, you're going to be breaking stronger than, than anybody else. This is an inspir Dude, it's wholesome video day. Can I get a hashtag wholesome video day in the comments along with your highs, please? I'm waiting to get like really tilted on this run and start swearing at it. <laughs> Okay, I'll take Nod Leaf. I'm never going to use it. I don't know why I would even take it, but... Fine. Devil Deal. Beautiful. Okay, this is this is spicy. We're, we're taking this. Because I know we have the HP to do so. We're now in Supreme Horror Babylon. Where we have no red hearts. And I'm okay with that, for the record. I would rather have no red hearts than, than some. If I'm playing uh, Eve. I would also uh, swallow my pride, jump on the line, but the lack thereof will leave me empty inside. Swallow my doubt, turn it inside out. Find nothing but faith in something. Want to put my tender heart in a blender. Watch it spin around to a beautiful oblivion. Rendezvous, then I'm through with you. And you're going, what the hell is he talking about? What, you're telling me you don't know the magnum opus of uh, Eve 6? Called Inside Out? What do you take me for? Okay, um... I have no idea what our HP setup right now is. Which makes going into curse rooms 
a little, little spicy, right? Like, it is definitely seemingly not an amazing idea to, to go into curse rooms right now. Stay in the middle. He dodged it. It's a difficult dodge, though. I'm getting better at it. Like, genuinely getting better at it. Um, I'm going to actually take the HP. And I know you're like, you psycho. What the hell's wrong with you? We, we have the HP. We, we don't. Well, I mean, we, we had the... We didn't have the HP. Now we have the HP. And we're still okay. Is the, the long moral here. We might die from this. I died from this. <laughs> I want to put my tender heart in a blender. <laughs> Watch it spin round to a beautiful oblivion. Wait, I went for the big brain play. It was not big brain enough. I'm not taking hits immediately in the room. Okay. Is Eve the new curse? More curses? Question mark? No. We're, we're fine, okay? Just because we've had a, a rough go or two with Eve. Yeah, just don't pick up the coin. It's fine. Um, just because we've had a rough go or two or three with Eve does not mean that we are screwed forever. It does mean that this video will probably be like eight years long. So at this point, pause the video, go grab your snacks, come back and uh, enjoy eating some, some goldfish or something while you, while you watch the video. What's the best snack that you could eat while uh, watching a YouTube video? Dude, I think goldfish are, are high on the list. Seriously, I'm gonna have you hit me actually. Um, the reason why I think goldfish are high on the list, low crunch factor. You know, at first I was gonna say pretzels, but pretzels are the large crunch factor, thus you might miss a word or two in the, uh, in the YouTube video if you're hearing the crunching in your own ear. Could be a little bit distracting, whereas goldfish have the, the melt in your mouth factor to them. I did not run into that. My my freaking Joy-Cons drifted. You're going, you're not playing on a Switch. I, you can't prove that. You can't prove that. Um, I think Goldfish is a really good answer. Potato chips are too crunchy too. I mean, sure, you could go for uh, a chocolate bar or something, but it, it doesn't have the longevity. You could pour yourself a bowl of Goldfish and they would stay, they could stay with you this entire video, even if it's uh, an hour long video. Just eat the goldfish slow, stupid. You're going... <laughs> where, where did this episode go wrong already? What's, what's a little bit of excitement and banter on a beautiful Wednesday? Is this going on Thursday? I don't... Look. I don't know what the hell day it is or what video this is for. I don't know. Crap. It's a golden keep, dude. That's, that's the most exciting thing I could have ever seen in my life. I can't access that because I don't got any bombs. I don't got no bombs, dude. Oh, what the hell? How am I supposed to handle this? Don't you? Aren't you trying to help me? Okay, I'm just going to leave. Um, we can go to downpour, though, which is very exciting. Uh, it means that I will not be taking that item room. We come here. We go down. It's the beginning of the end for us beginning of the frigged up end now that we're in downpour the world's gonna implode okay what am i looking for i feel like we genuinely my entire recording session today which is the last like three videos i haven't had like a single item where i was like heck yes like we got polyphemus on the on the one run but we had we had friggin dr fetus with it which i don't give a damn about don't really want to deal with that so it's just, I don't care. Oh, wow, dude. Talk about the value in this room. I had no thanks. No thank you. I don't really want any of the things you'd be offering. Oh, it's you. My favorite. <laughs> just my favorite enemy in all of anti-birth. Thanks for hitting me in the head with a, a bucket. What did I take damage on? Pardon me? I think you're crazy. Okay. Will I go for the boss fight immediately? I think I will, to be honest. I think I think you just go all in on it right now. Dodges. He's intelligent. He's smart. He's kooky. He's got it figured out as Wormwood. 
I would do that again the exact same way, to be honest. Okay. Don't be HP. That You're just despicable. Uh, two hard deal. Two one hard deals. Book of Sin. And a quarter. <laughs> I didn't even know a quarter could spawn in a Rebirth Devil deal. I mean, somewhere along the line, I did know that, but... Uh, that is something that has escaped from my brain for sure. Um, hey, a quarter is not the end of the world in the slightest. We have tinted rocks on the floor too. Keep that in mind. That's a red heart. I got no interest. Don't even bother. Okay, we're... It's not a terrible setup. Um, it's also only downpour one. Which means that this shop... Oh, wow, we still have the item room. I completely forgot. Um, this shop could end up actually providing us with a, a good load of value, depending. Key? Not a key. So here's the... Here's the question of the hour. Is there a key for, for sale in here? Oh, son of a gun. <laughs> the Bible? Stopwatch. Oh my god, dude. And now we're gonna have a boring-ass run with stopwatch? Really? Stopwatch is so boring, dude. You didn't give me a key from this. Wow. Do I want the Bible or do I want Book of Sin? Book of Sin's better. For us, at least. Wow, this sucks, man. I, I, I misplayed again. I mean, I didn't misplay. I, I very purposely played. Son of a gun. Um, it's fine. It's fine. I'm just a little salty, that's all. Just means higher planetarium chance. Am I right? Am I right or am I am I right? Just go. Cry yourself to sleep tonight. It's fine. Take a sip of tea. And we'll uh we'll continue on the merry way that we call life. Electric word life means forever and that's a mighty long time. But I'm here to tell you, you're probably going to die, because you suck. Wholesome, wholesome video. Okay, you're dead. What are you? 48 hour energy. A key? A key? I say here, here, but nobody wants to, uh, nobody wants to come hither. What about a, uh, a little key action here? Anybody else seeing how, how cruel and sick of a joke this universe is? Or am I the only one? A key? Okay, 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 okay. I really don't want a 61% planetarium chance, for the record. Which is what we would have if I skipped this item room, too. Hey, we've done it. Okay. Show me the money. It's terrible. Terrible money. Uh, I'll take this, because frankly, I don't really want the leech to be filling my red hearts if we end up having an empty one at some point in time. That's big brain, but it's, it is what it is. You gotta sometimes go big brain to go small brain. Explosive diarrhea. No thanks. Still gotta get the knife piece. Do not forget about it. I've gotten better at not forgetting the knife piece, which is good. You think that's the secret room? That was a great shot by me, dude. It was the secret room. He's a god. Okay. Um, I'm just gonna bomb it. And somehow we got the value that I wanted out of it, out of the Book of Sin, instead. It's also probably a library at the beginning of the floor, um, now that I'm looking at it. Is it more beneficial for us to go to the library than it is to go to um, the the shop? It Okay, never mind. It's the shop. I was just blatantly and brutally wrong. It's fine. Hematema telepills. Which brought me to the shop. It's honestly, some, some whack job stuff right there. Uh, I'm going to buy Mr. Boom. And reason being, we can get ourselves uh, another soul heart. We also then have the bombs. I don't really want to keep Mr. Boom. I just wanted it because it's five bombs for 15 cents. Uh, which is an amazing deal. And now we can get down to uh, Thingmajiggy. Easily. But, um... Hey, I'm I'm content with this. <laughs> Dude, I'm gonna tell you right now. I don't wanna be the guy, okay? But when they changed the stopwatch, it, it was actually one of the best changes that they've ever made in Isaac. Also, we can see exactly where he is, which is hilarious. <laughs> he's he's just straight up not here. 
He's gonna slowly. <laughs> okay. Stopwatch is so boring, dude. It, it's actually just the most boring item on planet Earth. Um, I'm so happy they changed it to not be as overpowered as this. It's so boring. I mean, it, it's literally an instant win item. Um, which maybe that's something you're interested in. It is something that I have actually zero interest in. But that's fine. I mean, look, it just means an easy win today. It means that I can sit and banter for another uh, 30 or so minutes. Let's do question of the day today. Uh, this, is a, this is a question from Egg. And Egg asks, what are some of the most common traits for video games that you consider fantastic or even just really good? This could be difficulty, well-designed bosses, great music, or even things like range combat. Just as long as they're traits that are pretty common for your upper list of fantastic games. That's a really, really good question. Um, you're also going to make me think about it. I will say, you, you definitely spurred a big part of things for me for a second there. Um, for me, great music goes a long way in a game. Uh, and I, I'm going to actually extend that to be sound effects as well go a really long way in games. Um, games that have a high production value are often going to be, even if the gameplay is a little bit wacky, they're, they're going to, to be higher in my books. And that's, that's something that is unique to me. Uh, there's a lot of people where the visuals of a game just literally don't matter to them. Um, if the gameplay is not good, they ain't playing it. And I'm, I, I can understand that. And I do tend to be more focused on the gameplay, uh, than say like a story, but I'm definitely one where, you know, they say, don't judge a book by its cover. Pretty low chance. I'm reading the book. If the cover sucks. Okay. Um, it just is what it is. The human brain is interested in, in the visuals and the audio of something, uh, over the, um, uh, over, over other things, at least when you're starting out. Um, some components that I, I really like in video games, if things are, th there's a replayability that comes with me, um, where you constantly have to be evolving your own gameplay to succeed. Um, I don't like games where it's like, once you know the core mechanic of the game, there's not much else to to understand, right? I'm gonna use for an example a game like Kingdom Hearts, which, if many of you know, I'm I'm a I'm a fan of the Kingdom Hearts series. Uh, I think that it's it's at least a a fun series and and an enjoyable one to play. That said, the Kingdom Hearts games have a lot of flaws. Um, once you understand the core core combat mechanic, they don't change it. A whole lot there's not a lot that if you were to replay the kingdom Hearts series you're gonna do things differently there's very clear you know this is how you should handle this this is how you should do this stuff like that right i like more you know take a game like take a game like assassin's creed okay assassin's creed that you can you can kill somebody many different ways in an assassin's creed game or or think like hitman if you're if you're in the 21st century um with hitman you can you can go about missions so many different ways that you're constantly trying new things it's highly replayable uh there's there's fun unique mechanics involved with uh how you're killing the people off we're full hp i thought we were literally like no HP. We're full HP. Okay, that's that's wacky. Did not expect us to be full HP. Oh, but that's cool. There's our planetarium already. It's actually a pretty low chance we're getting this earlier than usual, but that's okay. Um, I like the replayability, which is why I tend to to gravitate. What is this? Soul. Okay. I, I will see if I can figure out what this is over the course of the video. Somebody has already, before I even said that, they have commented with exactly what it does and then are going to be made a fool out of themselves when later on I uh, I say I figured out what it is and we, we move on. Um, also, I took anti-grav. I, I don't like anti-grav. But we might as well go for some kind of wacky synergy on a run that is uh, I literally can't lose. Because <laughs> we're, we're kind of in the the very strong setup here. I'm going to try and get Steam Sale too. And this will make it quite easy on us. 
Beautiful. Take this. It's good stuff. Um, but no, that's why I gravitate towards roguelites because they have that replayability factor where they're, you're constantly using new items, having new combinations, new synergies, um, things like that. So I would say replayability is a big part of the the game game mechanics for me. Um, I also like the idea of, of exploration in a video game. Um, you know, th games like you know Minecraft, where where you're constantly exploring new terrain, new worlds, being able to to have creativity and making your own. Uh, judgments for things and stuff like that i really like why was i getting battery charges from this i have no idea i also now lost my curses and can see my hp i don't i don't want a little brim here i'm like super confused dude. i have no idea what the hell is going on Okay, I'm going to do a fun thing called look up what soul does. Soul, anti-bird. Activate, oh, here we go. Upon defeating a boss, activates the sun card effect. Fully recharges my active item, grants a two times damage multiplier and plus one luck for the rest of the floor. And removes any curses. And it reveals the boss room on the map at all times. That What a cool item. Okay. Uh, I'm with it. This just means that we we basically bum rush the boss every single time. I have nothing else to do on this floor. Go. That's fun. I like that. That's a very interesting item. Um, so boss is that way. Guess where I'm going. We, we bum rush the boss to make our, our future even better. We need another tears up, dude. We also like kind of need a, a damage up. We need a lot of things on this run. Uh, it's just the run is very easy because we're... Uh, we're chilling hardcore but i mean look here here's my here's my favorite games of all time you know it's like minecraft isaac uh kingdom hearts but mainly because of like nostalgia more with kingdom hearts not the game itself like i said the game is you can say what you will it's not that good uh um chat dude i hate anti-grav so i'm gonna take the thing that that takes away anti-grav even though Clearly, the the probably correct choice is to go with the uh, penetrative shot there. But I, I stand by my decisions. It's just my decisions. I'm not sure if my decisions stand by me is my... <laughs> not sure if that's where I want to go with it. But it's okay. Um... Look, we're, we're still, no matter what we do on this run, we win. So it, it kind of doesn't matter in the end. If, if you really like anti-grav and wanted me to rock an anti-grav run, I'm sorry. But I feel like most of you would rather me rock a tech run anyway. Um, just because tech can be, and the thing is tech is piercing as well. So in the end, I just got rid of a good item. Uh, I, I, got rid of, I got rid of a bad item for, well, a seemingly bad item. Actually, we... I think we came out on top here. We we got the tears up from anti-grav without the, the downside of anti-grav. I think I'm walking away as the true winner in this scenario. Okay, no devil deal. I also don't want that. We now have... Why did I... I beat the boss, dude. Why, why did I not get the... Uh double damage or not. Is it because the boss technically I didn't kill him, he kills himself? I, I think we have some shenanigans on our hand here, if I'm being completely real with you, but... Oh well. It, it's fine. We, we can still... Honestly, I don't have anything else to do on this floor. I think I'm just gonna go. Um, I actually don't care enough. This is fine. J just leave. Just leave. We can always do the boss quickly on this floor too. But I don't know, man. There, there's there's a lot of things I like in games, and I, I like a lot of different games. Um, I also one one big thing for me is I don't like I don't like it when games I I like hard games. 
Like, I don't like when games gatekeep difficulty. I like a game that, that can, can have different difficulty modes that can definitely, like, you, you see improvement as you play and you don't feel like, you know, a game that is an easy game for me is not the game for me. Um, but that's, that's not really about the, the makeup of a game. It's a really hard question. You'd think that it would be an easy question. Um, but it's, it's harder than you would think for sure. I would love to know your guys' opinions as well for this question. And there's going to be a lot of comments on this video. <laughs> I've now asked for like five different comments on this one. Um, sure. Was it worth it? I mean, two, two soul hearts. Not the most worth it in the world, but I can clear all the enemies without taking any damage. So, like, uh, who the hell cares? Who the hell cares? Nobody cares. I don't know, man. There's a lot of games in the sea. Um, I do think that visuals matter, though. Um, look at look at a game like Iris. Okay, Iris and the Giant. If you don't know what Iris is, we've been playing it on the channel recently. Um, it's a very good roguelite kind of deck builder uh, setup with a beautiful story and some of the best art uh, in a game I've played this year. If the game was presented to me as just the deck builder without such beautiful art, I probably wouldn't have played it. Just because the art is what caught my eye, right? So I would say that the artwork has a, has a big deal to do with you know whether or not I play a game. When a dev sends me a game, uh, the first thing I look at is you know art and music of the the trailer or of the gameplay clip that they send. If that doesn't look good, then I'm going to be hard pressed to want to take the time out of my day to do an Alexa look on that game. There there has to be some kind of redeeming quality to the to the trailer slash gameplay clip for me i will take odd mushroom um th this has to pay for itself in the end yeah i this is a hundred percent worth it i i also i mean it's, it's now ear piercingly loud but it's fun <laughs> we, we have double steam sale okay no restock in anti-birth so don't get uh don't get too excited, but um, definitely still enjoyable nonetheless to have free shops for the next floor. Let's fight this guy, and uh, I mean, hopefully we just get the benefit from soul at the end of this. I have a feeling it's just a bug with the boss that we, yeah, okay. It was just a, a, a weird interaction with the boss that we had uh, before. Now we got good amounts of damage. Am I going to do the rest of the floor? Looking for stuff. There is another shop. It, it definitely value to go do uh, the other side of things here. So let's bomb right here. Beautiful. Pop that. Come in here. And to the other side we go. Money is completely irrelevant on this run unless we find... Uh, money is equal to my power which is probably a pretty low likelihood of us finding that item it's a one out of you know some some large amount of items hey double steam sale doesn't work in this what the hell dude rebirth was missing a lot <laughs> okay that's fine two of clubs two of spades do i need voodoo pin i really don't um don't need the bombs either we can just Continue on on this charade here. Son of a gun, dude. They really made the game easier in uh, Afterbirth. 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 Game got way easier. Don't need that. Um, I don't need any of the rest of this. Let's just go. Get the hell out of this. Uh, out of this floor, and I'm gonna be real. Get the hell out of this run. Um. We're, we just have to walk to the finish line. That's all that really matters at this point. I'm tempted to just, like, we, we can win this run with what we have. I'm trying to figure out if I care enough to, to even min-max a lot of the rest of this. Now, we could just re-roll the run right here and then make the run interesting again. If it's a, if it's a 
Reroll? Is it? It's not. I would have rerolled too, uh, just to see what we got. But uh, sadly, not an option. I'm gonna bomb through here, actually. Got a tinted rock, small rock. No small rock. What are you? Some pills? Explosive diarrhea luck up. Honestly, kind of legit for us. We get this now. More pills. It's, it's a luck down and an explosive diarrhea. What a fascinating uh, duo right there. Yo, what in the world? We have some splitty boys. I hated every second of that. Okay, our secret room might have been in that room, but I'm mainly beelining for the boss. Although boss fight will be mom. So we can't beeline too fast. And if we beeline too fast, then we're going to have to change our head coach. Am I right, Cleveland Cavaliers fans? It's okay. I'm allowed to make fun of the Cavs. They're my team. If you don't know the, the joke, we fired a guy whose name was Beeline. Okay. There's our knife piece. Snag that before you forget. I, I, I'm not going to be the guy who doesn't go to the item room. And especially, oh, I mean, it's right here, though. <laughs> I kind of just, like, I know you want me to min-max the run. I kind of just want to get it over with. Give me this. It's such a boring run. There's no excitement here. It's just a waltz to the finish line. Easy win. Like, who cares? Nobody cares about this run. Not a single person cares. You might be sitting here going, I care. I don't care. If I don't care about the run, you have no reason to care about it either. We, we, we just have to get to the finish line. Don't do that. You know better. Don't do that either. 100% chance of a deal, by the way. I know Spoonbender is not in the devil deal pool, but it'd be lit if it was. Okay. Beautiful. Give me this. Come in here. No freaking... Okay, I mean, one guppy item... I don't believe we have any guppy items on this run, though, so not really beneficial. Come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. Like this now. Look. It slowed down mom tart. What do you take me for? The problem is our damage is not actually that good on this run. Um, so we have to... We're in these rooms forever on top of it. But that's okay. We're, we'll be fine, dude. Like I said, it's an easy win. It's just the process of getting there is a pain in the rear end. We're mainly hoping for a phenomenal set of four items at the end of this. Come on, come on, work with me. Beautiful. Hella pills. Sure. We'll do this. Pop this. Take these. See ya. Brought me basically right next to the boss room. So, that works for me. We'll just nonchalantly snag that real quick. We can always go back uh, if... Hello, Wormwood. <laughs> Yikes. Uh, we can always go back and and do more of the room floor. Floor room. Would love to know who the enemy is in here. It's Wormwood. <laughs> Long time no see, buddy. Okay. It's Rotgut. Hello, rat gut. Have a bomb. I'm sorry that you you just are not hard, rat gut. That's actually interesting. So that triggers soul, even though the boss fight's not over. All right, fine. I'll go down. That's okay. Time to phase two this up. None of his shots can hit me, so it doesn't really matter. It's just you, you can't sit here and go, oh, I like stopwatch. I have a lot of fun with this item. Like, there is nothing fun about this. The I is literally hold right simulator. This is the most dodging I've done. Wow, I got hit. The most dodging I've done on this uh, run. All right. After a hard fought battle, he's finally done it. Is this a tears up? It's not. Okay, thank God. Um, 
So we die if I lose the rotten heart, so let's not do that. Um, many people have told me that. Just go down. We, it, at this point, this is one of those runs where it shouldn't have ended at like 45 minutes. It should have been way more, so we, we take the, the easy win and run. And that just means that y'all can go and watch uh, the next video that comes out today. Even though it's not Isaac and you probably won't. But I would love it if you did. If that makes you feel better. Here's the wholesome thing to do for the video. Is to go and uh, watch another video from me. That is not Isaac related. You might even learn about a new great game. Honestly, if you love Isaac, you would love Space Gladiators. The game we've been uploading here recently. It's very good. It's a mix between The Binding of Isaac and Hollow Knight. Which, if there's one thing I've learned about uh, the Isaac community, is that the Isaac community also loves Hollow Knight. Except many of you have no idea I have a 30 episode Hollow Knight series on my channel. That you could go back and binge watch. And I would not, I would not complain. I would not complain. My Hollow Knight series was very fun. I enjoyed that game a lot and I will be playing Silk Song when it comes out. Okay, let, let's get the hell out of here. Please. I went the exact wrong direction because I thought that we were uh, moving towards uh, a finish line. We were not moving towards the finish We were moving towards jag diddly crap. What's in here? Is there like eight wormwoods? This is like my worst nightmare. Come on. One dead. Another one bites the dust. Doom, doom. Another one bites the dust. <laughs> Okay, this runs over. Give me a beautiful, uh, whatever the spoon bender. That's the word. Boom. Now what you're looking for? Taurus. Now what you're looking for? Roid Ridge. Now what you're looking for? Bomb bag. Now what you're looking for? Great effort. You did. You did try. <laughs> You tried, you failed. I appreciate it though. You have Taurus. Taurus, Taurus offers very little value for us. Do we want to knock out his arms first? Would that make you happy? Because I'll sit here and hit his arm. Don't throw a knife at me, you sucker. This will be the longest I've ever stayed in this room because believe it or not this run is actually like not that good but That said There's there's still I Was gonna say there's still a chance we lose there's no chance we lose I, I can try and just sit here and be like oh, I'm scared I've got 6 HP, although I did just run into him twice. I got 6 HP and I'm, I'm, everything slowed because stopwatch is boring. If we had lump of cold, dude, this guy would have been dead like eight years ago. I don't really like these two balls of tears just chasing after me. Oh, is that the damn oh, son of a gun? Come on. <laughs> what a what a what a whack job uh when you actually like look at this crap dude and realize what they want you to dodge in real time my lord he's a difficult boy -o. he's a difficult boy -o. luck down we end the run thank you guys so much for watching birdcage has appeared in the basement lovely day to be alive we are now sitting at blue baby and Laz are the only two we haven't done which is wild didn't think this was gonna go this long uh but thanks so much for watching i'll catch you guys in the next video you'll have a good one Bye-bye.